What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to Tactics on the Bench. As always, it's your coach, Andy, and today we continue with our reaction videos. So we're taking a look at one of the most insane and I would say probably top 10 strikers of all time. One of the best number nines, a three-time Ballon d'Oro winner. I'm talking about Marco Van Basten. This man roamed the pitch here in the Johan Cruyff Arena. In fact, he probably even sat Johan Cruyff on the bench because he was that good. This kid at the age of 16 came out, came on the scene, and he just stamped his name all over the place. Uh, also an AC Milan legend. Wait, I mean, what else am I going to tell you? This guy was crazy. Let's go ahead and see. Thank you to Barbosa Football Videos for putting this montage together as well. Let's check out Marco Van Basten. All right, guys, and before we continue, please feel free to smash that like button. Actually, don't feel free. Just do it. It's free 99, actually. Um, also, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Oh, and did I say subscribe already? Like, subscribe, comment down at the bottom. Let's go. There he is, the man, the myth, the legend. <laughs> and one of the best things I love about Barbosa's football videos is that this guy, he always starts it off with some really, really great skill show. And uh, he's not going to disappoint. Watch. Ready? Look at him. Oh, the touch, the quality of bringing that ball down. Mm, you just, it, it doesn't get better than that. It doesn't get better than that. I mean, we do. We're spoiled because in this generation, we have two prolific players. But this guy was just something else. Look at that. Like, what a header. Honestly, that was super lucky that the ball rolled back in. But, like, just, just to be able to do that. The man had great quality, great touch, great confidence. The one-on-ones with him are just insane. He just makes it look so easy. Take that shot. Boom. Beautiful, beautiful strike. He knows where the goal is. He doesn't have to look up. He just takes that shot back of the net every time. Look at this. Great speed. Good control. He's not worried. He knows what he's doing. Brings the ball down. Goal. And and if you're if you're a kid in the sport today, make sure you take your time. You have confidence. You slow the game down. And this is what happens, especially if you're a striker. Slow the game down. You see everything that's going on. And you're able to go through that ball. Oh, and that that right there is so classy. He hits the ball, hits the bottom, like hits the floor. It bounces and nothing the goalie can do about it. He's not expecting that to happen. Beautiful header in between two defenders. And he gets up and gets the header. Lovely. Look at that. Wins the ball back. Nice chip. Oh, <laughs> you love to see it. I'm telling you, this guy is just insane. He has headers. He can shoot with his right. He can shoot with his left. Oh, the lovely skill and touch in front of the goal. Get it, Van Boston. Oh, no, dude. <laughs> He's so good. He's so good. And a rocket. He's just, it's electrifying. Imagine having been in Italy or in, in Netherlands watching this guy play. Oh, no, 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 no. Look at this. Sets up. Bang! What a bicycle kick. And sometimes we take a look at that Cristiano, you know, Champions League goal. But that was phenomenal, too. This guy is on a different level. I'm telling you, top 10 number nines of all time, for sure. Like, how exhilarating would it have been to have been in the stadium watching this guy play? No wonder he wins three Ballon de Oros. No one before that time had done that. I love the confidence, the little chip he does. He sees the goalkeeper. He sees the back of the net. He knows he's not getting to it. Nice little chip right over. Oh, what a cannon with the left foot, dude. <laughs> you got to feel for the defender sometimes, though, because he you can see what he's doing. He's sitting back behind the defense. He reads the ball, and then he goes into the ball and finishes it. Great free kick. Nothing the keeper could do. That was just lightning quick. Look at this. And the effect that that ball takes. The keeper knew he was beat the whole entire time. Honestly, this guy gives Cristiano a run for his money. Oh, what a finish. What a finish. Confidence, composure. Curls the ball around the keeper just like that. And we got an ad incoming. 
Oh boy. Uh, Monday.com. If you wanna, if you wanna sponsor our videos, you're more than welcome to. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to skip the ad though. Oh, lovely stop. Another. Oh, that's class. See, take your time, be composed, and you get goals just like that. Dude, what an overhead kick. That is just beautiful. Almost a full bicycle. You love to see it. Like, Hugo Sanchez is one of the greatest. But right now, Van Boston is really good. And if you're interested in seeing that Hugo Sanchez video with all the bicycle kicks, click the link up below. Above. Oh, beautiful header. I mean, I'm telling you, this guy, as a striker, is giving Slatan and Cristiano a run for his money with all these headers. Great control. Rocket, what a rocket of a bicycle kick in the half volleys, too. Like, dude, <laughs> okay, 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 wait, hold on, hold on. Because you know, I always do these little learning lessons, right? Or if you're a striker and you want to learn how to maybe increase your goal average, this is super important for you to do. Watch what he does when he strikes the ball, he's going to strike the ball against the floor. Ready, bang. The keeper can't read that. The ball's gonna take an effect that the goalkeeper doesn't know. So he's just he's just gonna miss it. Beautiful, beautiful. This guy is class. No wonder he's he's won so many accolades. Regarded as one of the best ever. Amazing. What a rocket. Near post. Nothing the keeper can do. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> takes the guy out he's just confident on the 1v1 i love that and i and i would love to see i would love to be in the mind of this kind of player like what are they thinking when the ball's at their feet and they have somebody in front of them Ooh, beautiful little dish and the strike like this guy had goals galore probably a lot of like very important goals too Beautiful and be beautiful in between ball and then just nails it. Oh, you see how he brought that down with the chest? Brought that down with his chest and just unleashed the kick. It's very important to note that once again, I, I said it earlier, but he knows exactly where the goal is. It's not moving. All right. The goal isn't automatically going to sprout, sprout legs and just walk off. Make sure that as a growing player, you know where the goal is. As you're going to strike the ball, it's not going to move. So if you strike on target, you're always going to get it. Oh, dude, that see that takes a little bit of skill because how do you know that the, ch the chip isn't just going to go away? He, he's calculated everything he does, every shot he takes, every pass or every movement. It's all calculated. That is a mistake by the keeper. Keepers, be careful when you do that. Uh, and he just, he was there. He was there. Too. Ooh, that's the best defense is a good offense. His offensive skill right there was just really good. And, you know, unfortunately to him, he would have had a much longer career if it wasn't for nagging injuries. But you can see why he got so injured. He's just so quick. He's so fast in the ball. And he wants the ball at all times. So the defenders are always going to look to him. And the only way to take this guy down is by chopping down at him. Great ball. Even better finish. Good job. Oh, quality touch to keep the ball in between. And takes the, takes the strike with his left foot. Practice both feet. Makes a difference. And I'm, I'm seeing a lot of out-of-the-box strikes from Van Boston. Like, the best part is... When you're a good striker, you, you don't have to just score tap-ins. You can score outside the box if you have enough confidence to know that when you strike through the ball, keep your head down, it'll go low. Just like that. I mean, that was inside the box, but still. Let's see it. Dude, volley. Oh! <laughs> no! Wow, dude. What a ball. And then what a volley. Like, the keeper, he just, he can't do anything about it. He doesn't know. He Honestly, he probably even thinks the ball's going over. When he looks back, it's inside the net. At his best, one of the most insane strikers, as I've already said a thousand times. It just doesn't get old. 
the man could strike with his left with his right with his headers he even opened up the opposition for great passes and passages of play it's just insane it was an amazing time let's go ahead and continue on to the next player smash that subscribe button down below hit that comment box as well let me know who else to react to and uh, as always keep the bench one all right guys and as we finish off this video i know you're probably waiting for the credits to roll and everything but uh make sure you subscribe down below hit the notification icon because the sauce is coming to you it's my new podcast i'll be launching it very very soon i just got a couple more details to finally tune and uh we're gonna be getting to some of the hottest topics in football and uh right now it is spicy out there all right guys i'll see you on the next one